Welcome to the European Endowment for Democracy. We would like to ask you a couple of questions. The first one is, how did you find about EED? All right, first of all, happy to be here. Uh, you know, on this occasion to have this anniversary and uh, first of all congratulations to the European Endowment for Democracy. Well, it would be rather correct uh, and more precise to say that uh, we found each other. Uh, I represent the Georgia's uh, Reforms Associates, uh, uh, one of the prominent multi-profile think tanks in Georgia and uh, that's um, how our uh, sort of first encounter happened. Uh, uh, we had the EED representatives uh, visiting Georgia and of course they were interested to meet with a number of uh, interlocutors and uh, that's how happily we first met each other and of course uh, uh, we personally knew some and also from the EED there were some personal contacts even before but uh, 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 let me say at the organizational level, that's how it occurred, and uh, that was quite a lucky uh, uh, starting point. Um, we would like to ask you, how did you get the idea to start your initiative and your project? Well, as for the project in particular, uh, I direct, uh, uh, that's the Fact Check Georgia. Um, well, we felt an increasing demand in the Georgian, let me say, space for the uh, uh, fact-checking. Uh, it is rather a novelty in uh, uh, our country, in my country, uh, but that's been quite an increasing trend globally. Uh, uh, well, uh, nowadays in uh, uh, many developed uh, democracies, uh, the journalism uh, uh, cannot be really imagined, if I may put it in, in this way, without proper fact-checking a number of people. Uh, 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 let us say, media houses uh, do fact-checking. Uh, well, again I said that we felt the need in uh, Georgia. Why? Uh, uh, well, Georgia is a democracy, a developing democracy. Of course, we have our shortfalls. But nonetheless, there is a heavily polarized society politically. Uh, politicians, not only in Georgia, but elsewhere, uh, they tend to uh, manufacture truths. Uh, I would even say that that sort of a uh, in, that has become an industry of manufacturing the truth, and of course, uh, uh, citizens and consumers of our project they have the all and full rights to establish the truth in the Georgian politics, which is not an easy task. But that's where we try to help them. Uh, we check the factual accuracy of the statements and the claims made by politicians, government representatives, opposition representatives. Uh, and uh, we do our in-depth research, we analyze properly and uh, what is uh, uh, absolutely important, we provide independent judgment to the political speeches. Why it is important? It is important because words matter. Uh, 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 what politicians uh, uh, say, fortunately or unfortunately, that's rather a jokey, a jokey way, but uh, uh, they do affect our daily lives. Uh, what government says, it matters. And therefore, of course, uh, uh, we are trying to check the statements and the claims made by them against the reality. Not necessarily we are chasing for the lies, not at all, but uh, we are exposing uh, uh, those uh, uh, mischiefs if they do occur. And then, what does democracy mean to you? Well, uh, I was born myself uh, in the Soviet Union. And I was grown up in the Soviet Union. Uh, in the old days, let me say, when I was uh, still living in the Soviet Union, it was about uh, about the fresh air, uh, to, to, to say it that way. It was about the freedom, of course, but of course democracy goes rather beyond. It's, it's about freedom, but uh, 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 well, in the, in the nutshell, uh, what I can say now, it's about freedom of speech, it's about freedom of choice, internally or externally. Uh, it's, about, uh, it's about economy as well. It's about the freedom for business, etc., etc. And it's about the safeguarding the human, human rights. But most importantly, when it comes to my country now, it's about sustainability. As I said in the beginning, we do enjoy certain degree of freedom. Uh, democracy, of course, is in, is in action. I can, cannot say that, well, we're done building with our democracy and we still have many, many shortfalls. 
but most importantly, you have to have the sustainability, you have to have the irreversibility of the reforms, what we are conducted, and many uh, are in, in pipeline, but what, what is perhaps the major, major, uh, 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 perhaps a shortfall uh, to, to the Georgian democracy now is a question of sustainability. Is this sustainable enough? So I will answer that in the later stage, perhaps next year. <laughs> well, I would like very much to thank you for your time. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs>